Hey, what's going on guys? So today we got another client. Uh, this is a regular client that I do service for, like a little school boss. Uh, basically, this one is a 2012 E350 uh, B10. So we're going to be doing coils and spark plugs on it. So same thing as always, we got to remove this. This shield plastic thing here. We have to take this off to be able to get to the bolts here. Uh, we got the two here that we just got to loosen up a little bit. We got the sensor there. Uh, we loosen it up from here and then from the throttle body. So we get all this stuff out of the way. And then we can see some of the coils uh, on each side. And then inside here, see what we got. It's a little bit tighter but we still it's manageable we got the coils on this side and the other coils on the other side so i'm going to try to record as much as i can on getting this one done and hopefully uh it turns out pretty decently so i'll give you guys posted as soon as i start to disassemble this thing all right guys so here we go we got the uh cover off we got the intake uh, filter off. So right now we are taking a uh, we are taking the coils off from that side, and then I'm gonna jump on this one so he's on the front pretty quick, and then we we can start pulling them off and trying to get this done. So oh, yeah, see how it comes along and look at that throttle body. One side is darker than the other. But, alright, let's get to it. And once we start getting the, the coils off, um, so basically, these ones are 8mm, the plugs are 7 on the coils. There are seven. Um, that's pretty much it. And then we gotta do the little trick on the spark plugs so they will come off pretty easy. And that's about it. <coughs> Alright, guys. So I'll be right back as soon as we start getting them off and see how bad they are. I'll keep you posted in a second. Alright guys, so we got all the coils out, we uh, sprayed PB Blaster on the hole so it will start getting loose up, that way the chances of snapping the, the plugs are less if it happens, hopefully oh. so far I haven't snapped any of the plugs yet, but right now we're starting to take them off to see what conditions we're in. But for sure this hasn't been done and this engine already has like 400,000 miles or something like that. So I'll be surprised what kind of conditions they are in. Alright guys, so I'll keep you guys posted in a second. Alright guys, so right now we are taking off all of the, co uh, the plugs from this head, from this side, and then we're going to jump over to this side. And so far this is what we have found. This is the new one, and these are the old ones. Right, focus. So you can see there's a big old gap right there. And they all look like that. So, what do you think? Is there supposed to be a misfire or not? But anyways. We're gonna keep on going at it, and uh, as soon as uh, we find out, we'll figure it out. And yeah, it's an E450, E450 with a V10. <laughs> All right. All right, guys. So the plugs are in, the coils are in, the new coils, motorcraft coils are in. Now we got them all unplugged. We gotta cycle the engine for a second, so I will get some of that. Uh, PB blaster out of the system then we can plug everything back in and start the truck and everything will be 
nice so let's do that and then once I put everything back and get together we'll give it a crank and see how she acts up so all right, keep it posted, give it one second all right guys so she's back together she's not go fight her anymore she still has Arrancalo Yandy! She still has a... Uh, uh, what's my an O2 sensor issue. They all need to be replaced because apparently since the computer was throwing more, uh, more fuel to be able to keep up with the misfiring that it had. I'm pretty sure it burned out the uh, yeah, O2 sensors. And... So the auto sensors are showing up on the scanner. But other than that, she's idling 100% better than what it was. So we just gotta get the uh, Motocraft auto sensors on it and she be good to go. She has a, a slow crank. The start is going out. So I mean, it's a 400,000 mile truck. So can't really be asking too much out of it. And nothing has been done to it. So that being said, all right guys till the next one share like subscribe and help me help you and if you guys have any questions i'll gladly answer them all right later guys